What's going on guys? We're coming at you with another MLB The Show 19 challenge video. Today, we are only throwing fastballs. And fastballs, I think, lose me a lot of Battle Royale games because when I throw them, I seem to just leave them down the middle for some reason, give a hittable pitch, and they smack dinger. So we're going for 120 or more likes on this video. Subscribe if you guys are new on the road to 28,000 subscribers. In the comment section, feel free to let me know if you guys like challenge videos, if there's other challenges you want to see me try doing. Power swing only, contact swing only, bunting only. I don't know. There's just some ideas throwing them out there for you guys. And... I'm thinking if we go to our bullpen or something, I might need to try to find a guy with like four seam and two seam so I can throw two different fastballs. We're only throwing fastballs in this in this video and we're seeing how it can do for me. We're playing the Texas Choppas. Our opponent has 81 Jan Gomes, Daniel Murphy, Joey Wendell, Josh Donaldson out of butts on Mondesi, 81 Jan Gomes again, uh, 99 Willie Mays, 83 Yasiel Puig, John Lamb on the mound. We got Kobe Allard on the mound. Away team, again guys, only throwing fastballs in this video Chris Davis a line drive base hit 36 speed should be a double I hope oh lord okay Chris Davis stand up double for him one down Mark Reynolds one of my favorite if not my favorite battle royale hitters of the year coming up and ball four to Mark Reynolds four straight balls I wanted to try to hit a home run or something but we just didn't get a hittable pitch Ernie Banks, this card's been great for me too in Battle Royale. Why, look, look at that. I gotta stop. I get way too antsy sometimes and start trying to swing at everything. Ernie Banks, two on, one down for him. And he smacks it. High in the air. Not quite deep enough. 36 speed. I guess we could send him to third. I think he should be able to beat it. So runners on the corners. Uh, runners on the corners. Two on, two down for Diamond Dustin Pedroia here. His starting pitcher still on the mound. And Dustin Pedroia flies that out as well. Dang, I actually, I honestly didn't feel like I got under those. Obviously, I did. Uh, and it's time to start the fastballs only. I, I'm assuming he has a fastball. Yeah, okay. So, four seam and two seam. That's good. Yo, this is going to be difficult. All right, there we go. 0 and 1. Maybe try running one in. Right here, right here. 0 2. <gasps> Yo, see, that's what I do when I try to throw fastballs normally. I just throw them like I miss my spot and leave them down the heart of the plate. I think it's probably time to get our, our starting pitcher out of there. Yeah, we're going to bring in Tony Sip. Good news, Tony Sip also has two fastballs. Uh, let's see. Tony Watson has a fastball as well. Good. I'm not going to count Sinker's fastball for this video, I don't think. Let's go. 0-1. Yo, I feel like I might lose this game, guys. I'm just saying. There we go. Big out number one. That's huge. Schwarber making the play. I had a decent top half of the first inning. Like, at the plate, I feel like I did okay. I'm disappointed we didn't score there, though. I feel I feel like I had a great opportunity that I just kind of missed out on. <sighs> oh, Lord. All right. Yo, see, like, why am I so trash at locating fastballs? I mean, I'm trash. Okay, here's the thing, though. If you guys watch the videos, you're probably sitting there thinking, hey, you're trash at locating any pitch. So, Josh Donaldson coming up. Let's do high and outside. I love how I say high and outside and not even close to being outside. Yo! Hey, let's strike him out here, though. Almost hit him. See, that's my issue, too, sometimes. It's like, I either throw it, like, it either goes straight up like that, or I miss by a lot. I can't seem to get it close sometimes. I mean, other times I get it perfectly. I, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Brandon Belt coming up. Brandon Bell, there we go. Lead off base hit in the bottom of the second. Almost got him, good lord. Okay, Fran Mill Ray is coming up. Let's take the lead here. Let's take the lead, then get the final six ounce of this game. Get the W here. Trying to win a game, only throwing fastballs. We got to get some offense, though, if we're going to try to win it. Fran Mill Ray is out number one. Dude, I'm struggling today. 
Maybe it's because I'm hungry. I haven't eaten anything in hours and I'm really feeling hungry. I don't know if that's a legitimate possibility. I feel like it honestly is. I feel like my reaction time is worse when I'm hungry, but who knows? There's out number two. Pitcher spot coming up. I guess we might as well pinch hit here. Kristen Stewart pinch hitting, popping it out. Going to the bottom of the second inning, 0-0 zero, zero still. Trying to get to the top of the third, 0-0. Zero, zero. Then we got 1-2-3 for our lineup. I feel like we could hit a home run or something. Uh, let's do Ryan Stanick here. Hopefully that's not a bad decision. Adalberto Mani. I swear everybody I plays has Adalberto on their team recently. It's crazy how many people have been drafting them. There we go. One pitch, one out. I'll take it. I actually do feel like it's harder for me to, to I don't think pitching's affected at all. Uh, I do feel like it's honestly harder for me to hit though when I'm like kind of feeling lightheaded and dizzy and hungry. Dang, almost getting him out, but John Jay getting the base hit. Ooh. Uh, what happened? Hopefully we get the W here. I don't really know what just happened. Okay, we are getting the win. That was really weird. I guess let's go ahead, just get into another game, only throwing fastballs. We're playing the Baltimore Destroyers. Our opponent has 99 Willie McCovey, 87 Ricky Henderson, Jonathan Villar, Gary Sanchez, Mike Moustakas, Fernando Tatis Jr., Shohei Otani, Ian Hatt, Miguel Almonte on the mound. We got Christian Bergman on the mound. Away team, seeing if we can win this game. Only throwing fastballs. Bruh, you're kidding me. When I'm trying this challenge, we're seriously facing someone with a 12 and 0 nameplate. Oh, this is yo. I can, I can almost guarantee we're not winning this game unless I score like 10 runs. Schwarber, he might be my best leadoff hitter in Battle Royale the entire year. He's insane. Oh my goodness, let's go. Oh my goodness, yo, facing the 99 Willie McCovey to start off, dude. He only has one fastball too. I feel like this is not going to go well. Let's go. Oh, if we can get that to happen every time, we could win this game. Out number one. And what does he have? So he has righty, Ricky Henderson. Righty switch righty. So let's just bring in Ryan Stanek. Hopefully he can do well for us. I honestly don't know if our like uh, opponent actually lost connection last game or if maybe they, they just quit. Maybe they thought they got out and they're like, okay, I don't want to play anymore. Let's go. Is fastball only the way to go in Battle Royale? Like, do people not expect it? <laughs> I have a feeling we're going to give up a home run. Huh. Uh. Tie game. Gary Sanchez. If we can jam them. I think we get out of this inning. I think I do another, like, inside one. Gary Sanchez, let's go. That's what we need to do. We need to make sure we're jamming him. After one inning, tied one to one, we could win this game. So we have a 2-0 count to the first hitter, and I just want to show you guys only fastballs. You can see the pitch is thrown, only fastballs, if you're looking up there. Four seam five, two seam three. One for a fastball here. So, like, we've only thrown fastballs this game. I just wanted to, I just want to make sure since I forgot to show you guys that. But we've only thrown fastballs. 2-0 to Mike Moustakas. Brought in a lefty reliever. Getting the out. There we go. Yo, why is this actually not doing bad against a good player? Why is this actually sort of working? I guess maybe people don't really expect fastballs. I don't, honestly. Like, I mean... I don't expect anything when I'm batting. Ooh. Dang. Oh, dude. Uh, I don't expect anything when I'm hitting. I literally react to the pitch every time. <laughs> uh, he's stealing. Easy stolen base for him. Not good. Um, but I don't know. Maybe people just don't expect fastballs. Maybe that's why he's, doing, he's stealing again. Yo, good hit and run for our opponent. I was going to say, no way he actually goes home. Two down. Go ahead, run 90 feet away. We can't let him score here. We cannot. Oh, good pitch. That's actually really good. I got to go back to that same spot, I think. Oh, no. Let's go. Okay. 
One more high and outside. Just getting blown away so far. No reason to throw it high and Schwarber making the play. Now we just need to go ahead in the top of the inning and then close it out in the bottom of the third. We have 8-1, or 8-9-1, sorry, coming up here. Jason Kendall starting off the top of the third with a good base hit. Going to be in scoring position. Nobody down. Now we got a pinch hitter. Then the top of our lineup, Kyle Schwarber, who's been insane for me in this battle royale. Aledmiz Diaz advancing him to third. That's huge. Now Kyle Schwarber, all he needs to do is hit a deep fly ball. We take the lead. Schwarber going to score the run. Let's go. Schwarber throw, throwing, scoring the run. I swear. And you got, we, we talked about it a few videos ago. Everyone that uses Zach Britton seems to just only throw a sinker. It's just sinker, 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 sinker. All right, guys, going to the bottom of the third inning. Lefty, lefty, righty. We'll do Tony Watson, I think. Yeah, I'm going to do Tony Watson here. And I feel like a sinker counts as a fastball. I don't want to do it, though. Is a sinker a fastball? Let me Google that and see what the results say. Because I feel like technically it is. So, yeah, it's a sinking fastball. But I feel like, like, I don't, I feel like it would be cheating to throw a sinker. In the comment section, let me know. Do you guys think in this challenge I should be allowed to throw a sinker? Let me know. Because I could definitely do this challenge again if I end up throwing sinkers. It would work out if you guys think it's okay. Two outs away from winning. 99, Willie McCovey up. 0-1. Oh 0-2. Oh Schwarber, it's going to be tough. Schwarber making the play. Let's go. One out away from winning. No way, dudes. No way I win this game. No way. Ricky Henderson coming up. Ricky Henderson, terrible pitch. I threw it down the middle. No way he gets the third, which is good. Tying run in scoring position. Intentionally walking VR. He has a home run today, so we're walking him. Gary Sanchez. Let's bring in a righty. Let's do one of my righties here. Why did I warm up another righty? <laughs> oh, Lord, guys. I'm scared. I am. Oh, bad. Yo, we won. How do I do better when I'm only throwing fastballs than when I'm playing normally? I don't get it. Playing someone with a 12 0 nameplate and I win a game only throwing fastballs. I'm mad. I'm mad that I suck pitching normally and I seem to do better only throwing fastballs. I'm mad at myself for that. I don't like that that... I don't like it. If you guys enjoyed the video, though, be sure to leave a like. I feel like that was fun. I feel like that was an entertaining video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it because I had a lot of fun doing that. I wouldn't mind doing more challenges like this in the future. Only change-ups, only curveballs, only breaking balls, anything like that. Only power swings, bunting. I feel like this could be just a fun thing to do every now and then, even if it's the same challenges, too. So if you guys enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like. Let me know in the comments. Feel free to suggest others in the comments. Subscribe if you guys are new on the road to 28,000. Follow on Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, second channel. All that's down in the description. I will see you guys next time. Thank you as always for watching. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Peace out.